I do not see any right now. Oh, oh, I have that one marked already. Wow. I do want to go down here and touch these guys as well. The grub grubs. I I have a feeling they're gonna they're gonna eat my ass, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, more mafic rock, I think. Yeah, weird. Also, what's up with these random like carpeted tiles? That is so weird. I mean, I get that it was like a base, but just very bizarre. Oh, we got a new principal. All right, here we go. Something good. Ooh, snazzy soup, baby. Is anyone really worth getting though? Largest of floral scent? No, because I love I love filling my base with flowers. It makes it's good for morale. Decreased construction, can't do digging, no. And bathroom use, medicine, digging, supplying. <sighs> nah, we'll go with snazzy suit. And who's the most stressed right now? Ashkan. Ashkan gets the snazzy suit. Uh, can I get the snazzy suit? There we go. Ashkan. He's wearing a warm sweater already. Sean it is then. Freaking Sean. Always nice and uh stressed out. Hopefully that'll hopefully that'll bring you down a little bit. And let's go ahead and copy one of these wheeze warts. Copy. Boom. 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 Did I have one more? One, two, three, four. No, I think I thought about putting one there and then never did, so. That should be all right. Should be all right for now. Mr. Dreco, go back inside my base, please. I want to keep you in there forever. Let's level that off just so that water doesn't escape. One good thing about this, though, is that this cold right here is going to start to permeate through here, so that'll help cool off. The battery bank's a smidge, not a ton, but a smidge. That's one good thing we have going for us. And then after we tap a geyser, I think we need to go down. Down, down to the lava. Because we need petroleum. And I think you that's the easiest place to get it. That's the most common way to get it. You can get it like in little biomes and stuff, but I don't see any on my map that have oil wells or lava so we'll have to go down also what a sad room just saw a table and some chairs imagine if you went all the way over there and didn't didn't find anything that'd be such a shame all right more research uh memory toggle signal counter duplicate checkpoint the arcade cabinet nice i think i want to go for the uh this stuff though the uh, decorations. Speaking of, we do need to go get Thimbleweed, which is over there. Yo, look at that Paku. He looks mean. Tropical Paku? My guy. He looks like he is going to eat me. Look at that little fry egg, though. How cute. Right there, continuing that. This is almost completely dug out and sealed. After that, we can just start working on zigzagging for battery banks. Food has decayed, rotten pickle meal, no. Eat, people, eat it quicker. That's why we need power, because these fridges keep running out. This person just literally cannot run enough to keep this thing powered. No one has made it over here to do this yet, so we're just letting them run for now so they can catch back up, so. Hopefully everyone who's here is having a great night so far. Uh, it was a long day for me, but can't complain. Can't complain. Nice. All right, so this is down there. So that means when I destroy this, I can just let the bleach stone drop down here. It shouldn't, it shouldn't emit any... Uh, hello, I see that bleach stone right there emitting all that chlorine. That's literally what I'm talking about. Shouldn't emit any stuff. Did I just click through it? Bleh. I, I 
can't get it. Oh, maybe I'm clicking too high. There we go. Sweep that up. The priority nine. We got enough chlorine in our base. We got to get rid of that. Oh, and there's more here too? Bruh. Get rid of it. The chlorine is starting to take over. That's also a really nasty, really nasty pocket of air. Hopefully no one goes up there. Who is so stressed? Ruby. Ruby, 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 Ruby. Da, no, 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 no. Why you do this, do this, do this to me? Okay, perfect. Uh, you know what I could do is I could make this a nice edge. Um... Yeah, I could always put a door there if I need to. I don't need that one there because I want it to stay nice and insulated. Let's go ahead and have them do that. I don't want really to keep extending their thing that it takes to go out and get the Wii's awards, but things got to be done, you know. Actually, I can priority this up. Let's do that. Let's get them out there to get it done. I am a little bit concerned about the temperatures in the base. There we go. Should hopefully get them in and out quick. Hopefully with more of them there, this chlorine shouldn't affect them as much. It might get hypothermia, though, because it's so chilly. We'll see. We will see. More uranium ore, though. Good for rad bolts. Also, for anyone who has just joined, um, this is the first time I've played this game since the Space Out DLC came out. Space Out DLC came out a while ago, six months ago or something. But I haven't played this game for like a year and a half. So anything that's in that DLC, brand new. Also, I've never done rockets in this game. I've never made it to space. So that's the end goal, hopefully, hopefully for this. Normally, I die right before getting set up for space. Uh, water, temperature, something always gets me. Uh, sometimes even food sneaks up and gets me. Even though I have a ton of calories right now, I have 175,000 kilocalories. It might not last. We'll see. As you can see, we got people starving right now. Just hopefully it's because they're too far away. Also, building lacks resources. Which one's that? Oh, okay. This thing. Just because I got everything queued up on it. I really wish that wouldn't show all the time. But it is what it is. All right, so our algae, we're actually ticking down our algae. We were at like 50 tons yesterday. That's a little concerning. Hmm. But we'll, we'll have to see how that goes. Also, I don't really need this open. It's kind of just blocking everything. You close that. It is also kind of annoying how they come up and only like only one person will do a ladder at a time because it's turn based instead of having multiple people there ready to go. It's kind of annoying, but I mean, I get why they do it. Ooh, glass, just straight, glass, glass on your ass, just straight off the bat like that. Yo. And no one else is operating, which is what we really need. Supplying though. That's a lot of supplying. Nah, let's go glass. I'm afraid to get too many people in here too quick before we have showers and stuff set up. The toilets will become overrun and it'll be, it'll be a mess. Why is there bleach stone in here? Oh my God, get out of there. There's not supposed to be bleach stone in there. Only this is bleach stone. Right, can we sweep that up? Uh, where's, where's my sweepy button? Keep that a pretty high priority. Um, let me just pick that particular bleach stone. Let's get it over there. Get it over there where it belongs. Also, I'm shocked I don't have long commute uh, error going right now. They are having to travel quite a substantial ways, but I think these fire poles are really putting in work. I think it was good to get them in early.
All right, so they're almost up there. So we can go ahead and start preparing this area. So for power, let's pause it for a second so we can use our big brains. Um, how many can we fit here? We can fit quite a few, actually. I kind of want to keep them more towards the back edge, though. I should put a space in between them to let them breathe. If I don't do that, they'll probably heat quicker. Five? That's not that's not too shabby. I'm okay with five. And then the batteries you use are too high. Um, they don't really need to be mesh tiles. They can probably be actually they could probably just be regular basic tiles. We can make them three tall to give them a little bit of breathing area. Obviously, this is probably going to be a little bit overkill on the amount of batteries we need, right now at least. But it's better to have it set up and ready to go. Don't have to worry about it later. You know what? We can actually... That even? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, that is. We can put these as airflow. That way the air can pass through them freely. Okay, then we can power them up with the big batteries. Uh, let's not do the top row. Let's... Is this going to fit perfectly? Again, do I put a space between them, though, to allow heat? Nah. I think that's okay. I don't think I want the ones on the ends, though. Because if I do want to put, like, a, a wheeze ward or something there, I think I want the, the extra space. So we'll, we'll try that for now. All right, let's get some more batteries up and going. We'll put them here. Boom. All right. Then we just need to set a big dig command. And we're good to go. We go ahead and deconstruct this. That'll let bleach stone pour out for a little bit, but you know it is what it is. And then we can just let them run. Let them run for a little bit and cross your fingers that nothing explodes, so. <sighs> Feels good to finally get the power kind of set up and almost ready to go. Once we get all that finished running, we can run the power down there. Or not the power, we can run the, uh, the cables down there, set everything up. Ooh, actually. So for this, I'm going to need the big chonkin wire, aren't I? The heavy watt conductive wire, which takes this. Okay. Yeah, because that, that only has two kilowatts, and that branches off of the transformers. So I need more stuff being made, so let's just do it forever. For the meantime... This is the most efficient. Hopefully I can get a smelting station set up sooner rather than later, but it's good that I good that I noticed that now so I can get that kind of ready to go. Um, also, can I run heavy watt conductive wire on behind ladders? Is that something you can do? Or do they have to be through the floor? They might have to be through the floor. Hmm, we'll see. We'll see what happens. We'll play with it whenever we get there. So, you still in here, Sean, or did you go uh, you go play something else? I was curious to see what your little hiccup was today, if you were still around. Well, what was your hiccup? You said you were going to tell me whenever you got in here, but you never got around to telling me. Also, we need to get this chlorine under control. I think that's contributing to our stress as well. Working on the scrolling text now. Like, what do you mean the scrolling text? Like what I have at the bottom, like the ticker? You don't need scrolling text, bruh. Keep it simple. Kiss. Keep it simple, stupid. Keep it stupid, simple. 
Hey, you said you ran into a problem earlier. Ooh, our stress is getting juicy high. Who is stressing out? Ashkan and Dragon. Nicola. Don't like that. Ah, oh, these aren't powered as well. That's kind of a problem. These aren't at like a high priority dig, are they? Build? No, okay. Oh, this is still going on though. All right, once that finishes, that should make things a little better because they won't be running through the chlorine as much. Okay, okay. Yeah, because I thought you were going to go live tonight. Free scenes you got had code in them to put a water milk over everything after seven days. Oh, okay, I gotcha. Where did you go? Did you go to like that that site that starts with an O? Owned? Owned, I think, maybe? Is that the name of the one that's big? Oh, you had to redo everything? Yeah. She just bought it. It was probably, what, like 30 bucks? At that point, you put so much time into it. All right, no research. Let's go ahead and pick something else. What have we got? I mean, I guess we start from the top and work our way down again, just like we did yesterday. We're going to need it all eventually. So, makes sense. Oh, and yeah. You were thinking of it, but you're on a budget. I get that. I get that. I know the feeling. Yeah, I thought about using owned when I first started. I looked into their stuff, but I couldn't find anything that quite matched with what I wanted. So, that's kind of why I just went with more custom stuff. It's not quite as clean as their stuff, but, I mean, it's clean enough for me. Clean enough for me. All right, someone's getting real stressed. We need to get this up and running. Uh, right here. Can we put this at a priority like seven, please? So let me get down there and run on that. Thank you. Of course, Sean's the first one's in there because he's a little Bia. Decided to purchase a cheaper one and then also got a horror theme too. Nice. Everything is way easier the second time, of course. Of course, the first time is always the nightmare. Yo, where's Ashkan at? Ashkan, can you get over here and stop freaking out, please? Uh, my guy. I know it's not the best living conditions right now, but... Can you, like, chill out? Chill out, bruh? What is he doing? What's his errands? Here we are. Life support, algae terrarium, research, generate power. I guess it's just because he's in such a badly decorated place. Maybe? Okay, he finally got in the bed. Okay, good. So hopefully he'll get a little bit relief there. And then it'll... Hopefully he'll grab it in the morning before someone else can get there as well. Because ain't nobody got time for that. Ren, look at you go. Making all my, my copper that I need. I appreciate it. Big preach on that, Ren. All right, so carbon dioxide is getting thick still. Still thick. Still a thick boy. But it's all right. Gosh, kind of still way up there on the stress man. You gonna get stressed while he sleeps? Is that a thing? Nerd. I know, Sean's a nerd. There's no way I'm a nerd. There's no way you could be talking to me. It's definitely Sean's a nerd. Ricky scrolling text for info like your stream. I mean, a ticker is nice, yeah. Uh I mean, it wasn't too bad to set up. I think I think I found a YouTube video and I think I did it like in 15 minutes or so. So it shouldn't be too bad. Cutting off the text, you think you figured it out, though? Just had to reduce font size. Yeah, I don't remember if I had any problems with mine. I feel like mine went relatively smooth. Ooh, new principle. Let's go. Give me something to reduce stress. Algae. Or eggs. Cooking, rocketry, building, suit wearing, no. I don't like germ resistance being lower. Mm, ooh, but Pufflet's probably better in the long run because they're going to keep producing slime, which will give me algae. So we'll go Pufflet for now. 
Let's do that. Let's do that. Is this over here finally all swept out? Oh my god, they're taking their sweet old time over here. The moss slime lung is just running rampant. This water lock is still holding true, though. Well, there's a little bit here. Hasn't made its way into the base yet, though. Ooh, I need to start worrying about that, too. As soon as we get power done. That's our next project, is worrying about this overflowing. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll just... I could just pump it up into, like, a storage container up here, maybe? And fill that with chlorine. I got a bunch of chlorine here, but I can't really use it. All this chlorine is going to sink, but it's going to be stuck with this carbon dioxide. I could make a little basin here, try to get this chlorine to drop. And then put, like, my dirty water in there temporarily, just to store it, because... If I'm not mistaken, uh, like vats and stuff that are kept inside chlorine will actually kill the germs inside those those storage units. So maybe we'll try that. No one's building that one though. Okay, high stress, Ashkan's coming down, which is good. Building lack of resources. Electric grill, neurovesselator, that's fine. That's our oxygen. Ooh, way down on the oxygen production for that day. And there's our long commutes thing that I was talking about. Finally made its way back. Ooh, yeah, and the chlorine is picking up because we're not getting enough oxygen. Let's bump these up to a six. Because we need that oxygen. We need that O2. Might as well bump these up to a six as well. I'm really going to have to start pumping these out. Oh, and our water's getting low too. This just isn't keeping up because there's not enough power. Crap. This is why we need the thingies. What's temperature in here? All right, it's starting to cool back down a smidge. All right, it's a little bit more manageable. I'll take it. I'll take it for now. We are getting awfully low on water. Who's that? That's Echo. He's going to get starting stressed out. Of course I will. Um, Let's change this down here to like a priority three. Wait, no, priority three. That way we can get all this finished and built. Might as well start running these powers. Heavy watt wires. Like that. Oh, they can go behind ladders. That's nice. There we go. Connect all that up. Yeah, that's fine for now. How much should I, how much? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So switch this to a three as well. Um, and then you know what, actually I might have to get rid of these ladders and put the, the transformers here. How big are the transformers? I don't remember. Uh, that's a thousand watt transformer and that's four kilowatts. So what's our power overlay look like? That is not the power overlay. I mean, we could do one of the four kilowatts to just pretty much run all of this. Actually, one four kilowatt power thing might be enough to run this whole base. And then just run basic 1000 wire over here. I think we could do that. I think we could definitely do that. Oh, let's let the day take over and then we'll take care of that. What information are you gonna have in your in your ticker? I also I also only have that running in my break scene, intermission scene. I don't have it in my gameplay because it's a little bit too invasive for my taste. Um, we can go ahead and deconstruct all this actually. 
And let's build a couple airflow tiles here, I think. Same? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh, actually, is this going to be tall enough? This might not be tall enough. Let's check that. Oh, that would be an actual pain in the ass. Well, one of these. Okay. So how does this thing work? So it goes in the top one and it comes out the bottom. So we want it set up like that. Actually, we want the big one up here. Or we want the large power transform. Oh, it's awkwardly big. Well, well, that's fine. We'll put the small one, like, there. And we pr probably could get by with maybe one more big one. Maybe I should do two big ones at the top, but I don't have these getting set up yet, do I? No. All right, let's just do those two. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out in a little bit. All right, so as soon as these are done, then we will... Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, I used to do a thing where I would run the transformer and then I would have a smart battery on the other side of the transformer. So that way I could connect that up to all my things, all my power gens. So that way they would only run whenever that smart battery was below a certain percentage. But can I do that with four transformers on the same coal generators? Also, how much power do these output output? 600 watts. They're going to be running quite a bit. 600 times 5, that's 3,000 watts, so not even enough to power this large one by itself. But it's not going to constantly be running, so maybe it'll keep up. So I guess what I could maybe do is I could put, like, airflow tiles here with smart batteries on them. Oh, my God, they so thick. Why are you so big, boy? Jesus. Uh, all right, let's just get rid of some of these. All right, let's try this again. So, power. No, that's not power. I can't read, apparently. Large transformer. Boom. Regular transformer. Boom. Smart batteries. Boom and boom. Um... Oh, you know, I could just run the smart battery to the actual transformer itself. Yeah. And I could just store up all the excess, excess, the excess stuff here. And these things will stop running when these get to a certain level, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's how it works. I think. Let's try that. Okay, let's try that. And then I need to connect those up. So heavy conductive stuff, that, up to there. Then I need conductive wire from there into here. I guess we can run it like up, maybe. Okay, to branch it over here. I think that's good. And then regular wire for this one. We could probably run it down and then over. Because this is the one that's going to make the long journey. All the way over there. We won't connect it up yet, but I want to get it set up. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Um, please don't run this when it's not connected to anything. Please and thank you. Freaking dupes, man.
How's our chlorine doing in here? Is it getting pushed back down? Ah, they're sleeping in it, so it's not that good. But... It's looking okay. How are our resources? How's our actually algae resource? Down to 29.7 tons. It's dropping quick. Dropping quick. Once we get this set up, we gotta make sure we get the water flowing properly. We should probably try to work on getting another water system going. I don't think I want to do the slime again. I think I will want to go tap this. If I can get a little bit of power out of this, a little bit of water out of this. And maybe grab those thimble weeds. Oh, but I need plastic. I need plastic so I can go in there without getting scalded. That's kind of a problem. Mm, okay, I'll take the water. What do we have? Hard digger, iron gut, green thumb, yokel, cooker. Nah, um, I don't really need the food. Yeah, let's take the water. They can plop that straight in there. Free water. I'll never turn down free water. Also, look at all these animals. <laughs> They're so cute. Look at the little pufflets. I freaking love them. Wow. They're so cute. Good, good. Our oxygen gem was still a little low. Uh, we might have to actually get another oxygen thing up and running, but I'm kind of hesitant on that. I don't want to get more algae terrariums because they suck a bunch of water. Water is not a thing we can afford to use right now. Let's just get a little low. 